So EA dropped a brand new party bag player pick, the 87 plus team of the group stage winter wildcard or versus pick. If you guys are looking for cheap, fast and reliable ultimate team coins, check out MMOEXP.com. Link in the description, save 5% using code HABER. Now looking at this pick, I mean, you've got the likes of Neymar and Son from versus, got uh, Rashford from versus. You've obviously got the winter wildcard and team of the group stage already. 87 plus, let's see what we get. Thankfully, there's no more Ultimate Dynasties. Here we go. However, we still have not escaped Boniface. Or Boniface, sorry. I do apologize. I think I'm saying it wrong. Uh, we get Alexis Sanchez. It would have been great, to be fair. I think Alexis actually would have been quite expensive if I didn't already have him untradeable. Uh, Alexis Sanchez fire card is worth about... Oh, no, it's worth 60k. I don't know why I thought it was expensive. Um, but Boniface is still in these picks, which means he's still to be everywhere. Welcome to the club. All right, we've got Nix now. He's on Xbox, so we're watching it via Xbox. Let's see what he gets. Uh, no, again, not great. Berardi was worth a little bit when Winter Wildcard first came out, but still not great. Not off to a fantastic start, are we? Let me know in the comments down below what you guys get if you open this 87 Plus party pick, and also leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new around here, as it massively helps out the channel. We just It helps out with growth and whatnot. So, Dan the Gooners pick next. Let's see what we get. Ooh, Ice Marta or Ice DRB. I think, to be honest, I think both are all right. I'm really not that clued up with price. So DRB is about 100k and Ice Marta is about 73k. It's not too bad. I think the Fire version of both would have been better. The Fire version of DRB is just a bit more expensive, but it's still not bad. Uh, for me, I'd probably take DRB here. I think four star four. So this card looks really decent. Take Diaby. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm in the same boat as you there. We'll take Diaby as well. Travella just got nerfed. So Travella plus really means nothing to us with Marta. So yeah, it's not bad. All right, we've got Lala's player pick next. So this pick is roughly around 75,000 coins-ish. That's how much it is to complete on footbin. So anything over that is okay. <sighs> Winter wildcard Royce is sadly not great. He just, he just kind of fell off, didn't he? You know, Royce... A few years ago, you'd be really excited to get a special card. But nowadays, just l way lower pace and whatnot. It's just not that exciting. I'm also going to open up the Pulsar Pack on my account. Just because I'm a bit of a degen. And they just have such a good... Oh. Apparently, the probability is being updated. Well, they did have a decent chance. Like a 30% chance of a an icon. I just want to get Dino, man. Dino or Rooney on tradable would be insane. We don't get an icon. We got ourselves a double... Future Stars walk out. We've got Kudananji on the front, who I've packed probably about eight times this promo already. Hopefully, Garnacho or someone like that behind. Endo. That's awful. That's so bad. That is that is horrific. My word. I Look, it's my own fault for opening it. Don't get me wrong. I understand that. But, wow. Just woof. You know what I mean? Absolute woof. The follow is okay, you know, 291s and a 90. Uh, if that was joint team of the year, my word, I'd be going crazy right now, eh? All right, pick and pack for my boy Tunk Hanamon. Here we go. Player pick first. What are we getting? Ooh, ooh, okay. Fire of Charleston's not bad, right? I don't think Fire of Charleston's bad at all. I'm not going to lie to you, the versus promo was like the least interested I've been in a promo. So I really don't know the prices. Oh, never mind. Richardson's terrible. My bad. Renard? Is Renard good? My my fault. I feel like an absolute idiot right now. I do apologize. Um, like I said, I was really not that interested. Renard's 100k, so we'll call that. We'll call that a W. But the the yeah, the fire promo was the least interested I've, been, I've ever been in a promo on, on FIFA ever. So like, I don't know the prices of anyone, so I will have to check. But that's de that's decent. Renard's okay. We'll take Renard. 100k. More than the, more than the SBC itself, anyway. Um, all right. I'm going to open up one of these 84 times fives right now. And if, I was going to say, if it's a future stars, we'll open up the next one. EA, keep us opening these with future stars. We've got ourselves a... Is it bronze? It is bronze. We've got a future, future stars behind that. Who is the future stars going to be? Will it be someone good? We all know who that is. It's Jerma. <sighs> it's Jerma. Well, at least I think she's tradable. So, that's a W. All right. Next one. No future stars. E8, you couldn't even last two packs, mate. We got ourselves a midfielder from Barca who is going to be 
a center back called Irene Paredes. All right. Next 87 plus party pick. Can we get something good, EA? I don't know if that's good or not. I feel I feel so silly. I know Alexis Sanchez is okay. Roberto Firmino. That's an interesting one. Roberto Firmino ice card is about 60k. Alexis Sanchez is about how much is it? I know this is probably a really painful watch right now. I did apologize. I just don't know the price of these cards. 34k. Yikes. Once again, I can only apologize for not knowing the price of these cards. Um, I do feel really stupid for not knowing them. Um, it's just, like I said, the Fire versus Ice promo was like the one... I, like, I, I took time off during that promo, so I just don't really know the prices. So I'm, I am really sorry. Like, I do feel stupid. Uh, here we go, though. We get ourselves Ice Firmino, Winter Wildcard Lorente, who's not a bad card. Not insane, but not a bad card by any means. And then we get Winter Wildcard Dabinia, who's just kind of pointless, given the fact she had a really reasonable SBC. That's the exact same rating and more play styles, so... At least Firmino is probably a small W, I guess, in the grand scheme of things. And same with Marcos Llorente, who's honestly, I think, quite a decent card. But it's each to their own, I guess. Uh, Llorente's value, though, is about 100k, 110k. So he's worth more than the SBC, at least. All right. My boy Finch's player pick next. Hopefully, he's got the juice. He said he's got the luck. He said he's very lucky. Ice Renard, who's quite a lot cheaper than a fire card. So not great, sadly. Uh, and then obviously you've got Murato and Hudekiu, who are basically discard, I guess. But, eh. All right, we've got our next party pick. Let's get someone good. Let's get a Rashford. Oh, my word. I think that's good, right? Camavinga's solid. That's good, man. I'm sure that's good. I mean, the card looks sick, by the way. 200k? We'll take it. That's solid, man. That is good, yeah. I'm not going to lie to you, right? So I feel a little bit silly, because at first I thought that was Mendy. Because um, I think it's the... Is it Ultimate Dynasty's Mendy? That's like... Or Winter Wildcard Mendy. Uh, it's Dynasty's Mendy. That's 1.3 mil, right? I didn't look at the card at all. I just saw 87 left back Real Madrid. And I went, oh! But Camavinga's still really good. I think Ruben's got an 84 times 20 as well to open. Um, but that's still... Like, that's good. 200k right there. That's like triple the price of the SBC roughly you'll take it i mean that's solid that's the best one so far at least uh 84 times 20 now come on ea we do get a future stars we've got ourselves a spanish center back from Barcelona. it is going to be irene paredes who's not a midfielder by the way she is a center back who is going to be the uh future stars Bissek. fair enough I let them walk out now because I made that one mistake with Doku and I've not heard the end of it in the comments. So I just let everyone walk out now. They don't have game faces. So how do you, how can you even tell, you know? Anyway, um, for 84 times 20, technically six walkouts, it could have been a lot worse, but could have been a lot better as well. At least there's only what, like nine eighty fours or something. So it's not awful. All right, next party pick. Next 87 plus player pick. What are we saying? Ooh, Ice Lawrence. I haven't seen her yet. We get Fire Gunter and Ice Lawrence. Is Lawrence good? I know Mukiele's worth a little bit as well, actually. I, I'm not I'm not skipping over him. I know he's worth a good amount. 100k for Lawrence. I think Mukiele's worth a little bit as well. That dynamic image, by the way, is probably one of the best ones on the game. I do like it. Mukiele's worth about 55k. Is Gunter worth anything? Probably not, but we will check just in case. Gunter's worth about 20k. Brilliant. So Lawrence is the most expensive one there. And the dynamic image is just cold. Like, ice cold, literally. So... Not bad. My second account now. We're doing it blind. Uh, why not? We're doing it blind. Here we go. Medi Taremi. Brilliant. No, don't, don't, don't lie to me. No, don't lie to me. Saliba? Oh, I don't care about Saliba. Is that it? Winter wildcard? You guys are angry about winter wildcard Saliba? Same rating, mate. I don't care about Saliba. I don't care about Saliba at all, mate. He's mid. The SBC's better anyway. We'll take Taremi. Taremi's a, Taremi's a proven goal scorer, mate. I don't need Saliba. Taremi's off to Inter in the summer, mate. He's a proven number nine. That's all we need. 100 of your finest player picks. We're looking for future stars today, EA. We want future stars and future star icons. Starting off with a Rafael Varane. Hopefully, it follows suit United past and present. 
with Rooney, with Garnacho. I'll take a Dino. He didn't play for United, but like, you know, he was pretty good, weren't he? We'll just say he played for United and have done with it, I reckon. Uh, Erdegaard, our first walkout as well. Five picks in. Good start. We're on, a, we're on a decent start. We're on a decent start. We want to try and get ourselves um, at least from 100 player picks. I think two future stars is quite fair. The issue is I'll probably get two endos and that'll be it. I would not be surprised if we get two endos. I wouldn't be surprised if we don't get any future stars, to be honest. Um, I was watching a few people open these player picks yesterday and they're so hit and miss. Like, you might go three or four in a row getting walkouts and stuff. And then, like, the next... 30 will just be awful. So yeah, I'm a little bit I'm a little bit skeptical. I'm not gonna make you watch all of them. We will be back when we get something decent, but yeah. We'll see how it goes, I guess. I'm down. Hello, Endo. There's our first future star. Let's go. We got ourselves Endo. Ericsson right after. That means Garnacho in the third one. I don't make the rules. Okay, never mind. Well, we got our first future star. It was a bad one, but you know, we got one. How many was that in? That was 95 player picks in. And we got our first future star. Inform Adebayo as well. Maybe he's getting better. Maybe maybe we're going on a good run here. Because so far, we had a few walkouts, don't get me wrong. But like, there we go. A second future star. We get Barrios now. These are starting to get good right at the end. It wasn't 95. It was 45 uh, player picks in, by the way. That's what I said, 95. 45 player picks in. We got our first one. And after 50, we've had two future stars and a bunch of walkouts. Honestly, it's not a terrible return so far. You pat Dino from an 81 times 11. Wow. Hey, GG, man. Hello. Back-to-back -back walkouts. Let's go. No three in a row, but back-to-back -back walkouts is always nice. Maybe we're about to hit our first icon. We do get ourselves another future star. By the way, Kudnanji, fun fact, I believe has just transferred to Bay FC. Where she will be the record breaking transfer in women's football. 735,000 euros. Little fun fact for you. Shout out to John Barker for showing me. Um, yeah. Kudnanji. World record transfer in women's football. 735,000 euros to Bay FC, which is apparently like a new team. I looked at it. I think it's a new team in the women's MLS. So the American League in, in uh, the Women's America League. Well, fair play. That is, uh, I mean, it's a big transfer in comparison to a lot of the transfers. I think Oberdorf just went for about 250k. That seems like a massive transfer. Uh, I wonder how that pans out. But yeah, it's pretty cool. And we just packed her. A future star right there. He clearly, BFC agrees with EA that that is a future star. And we've not had anything since. Ooh, look at that. Back-to-back -back walkouts. Benzema's nice as well. Nice way. Benzema's huge. Three walkouts in a row. Come on. Come on, let's continue it. Four. Four walkouts in a row. I'm hitting the jackpot. Oh, boo. We got four in a row. You take that. That is, that. I mean, I think that's the most I've ever had in a row from player picks. Maybe I've had five in a row before, but that's, that's the real jackpot right there. Hello, we got ourselves Future Stars Germa. Not bad. Three Future Stars so far. We're doing all right. We're doing okay. We've not had a future star icon. That's obviously the next goal. Hopefully, we can get ourselves an icon. But they do seem very hard to pack. So, I will not be disappointed if we don't get one. Um, is there another future star waiting for us in one of these picks as well? We'll find out. Well, then. That is uh, 100 player picks opened. Three, four future stars. I wanted two, so we got double that. Um, and a bunch of walkouts. These are all the dupes that we've got left as well. I think we did okay. We didn't do too badly. We've got fodder. We've got some future stars. Overall, not too bad. 87, double upgrade. Come on. No future star. We've got ourselves uh, Modric. I'm just going to skip it. We've all seen a double walkout at this point in FIFA, haven't we? And it's a duplicate. Nice. Here we go. Future stars. Been waiting for this for ages as well. It's Germa. Go on, be a double though. Let's not be stingy here. Yeah. Double future star walkout. Let's get a good one now. Please. It's going to be Endo. We all know it's going to be Endo, but... It's Kudnanji. Okay. Well... At least we've got a record breaker. At least we've got a record breaking transfer right there. We'll take that. Three big packs to open now. 83 times 10, 83 times 20, and then 84 times 20. We've got an inform in the 83 times 10. It is Abu Bakari Koita, which means there's no walkout. <sighs> it's a shame. We'll go ahead and uh, discard that. Um, all right. 83 times 20 now. No future star. I was kind of hoping for an icon, to be honest. I didn't, I didn't even care about future. I was hoping for an icon. 
We go ahead and uh, store that in the club. Discard the 83s that are worthless. All right, 84 times 28. Come on, show us a an icon, please. Wow, it's just gold. Italy goalkeeper Donnarumma double walkout. I mean, it's kind of bad that I'm hoping for a double walkout there. Ronaldo, so Pop, Donnarumma, Cancelo, Ronaldo, Parejo, and Lawrence. Eh, pretty average. 